Hey guys, I'm Kayla and today I want to talk to you about some pointers that your stylist wants you to know when you come in for your next updo appointment. Bringing in a picture will help your stylist get a better understanding of what look you're trying to achieve. Please be realistic when choosing your picture so it is similar to your hair type, hair length, and color. Allison has brought in four different photos of what look she would like to achieve. This style is unrealistic for Allison to achieve because she does not have similar hair color or hair length. Please always keep in mind that most women you see in magazines with updos most likely have hair extensions to give them a fuller look. If you would like to have an accessory in your hair, it would be wise to bring one yourself since most salons do not sell them. It would be a good idea to have your accessory picked out ahead of time to make sure it balances with your dress and it's comfortable to wear. If you want a lot of volume in your hair, don't choose a heavy accessory or it will weigh down your hair. Whatever accessory you choose, wear it a few hours beforehand to make sure it's comfortable. These two styles are realistic because they have similar hair type and hair color to Allison's. This style is almost a perfect match to Allison's hair length, color, and hair texture. We were able to recreate Allison's desired look based on our consultation. Since Allison did not come out with freshly washed hair, her curls will last longer and her style will hold. Believe it or not, but unwashed hair is easier to work with. It's going to hold the curl longer and easier to create volume by backcombing. You're going to want to sacrifice washing your hair 12 to 24 hours before your next updo appointment. If Allison had came out with freshly washed hair, her curls could fall and her style would not last through the day. Thanks for watching guys and stay tuned for more. Like and subscribe or comment below if you want to share your experience with updos in the salon.